Hey, YouTube and Sendar here today with the 2020 version of all the Calpheon NPC vendors of importance with console support. I'll start each NPC from this location here, just north of the storage guy in Calpheon, and do these in real time today, but try to keep it quick too. Let's do it. All right, so we'll start today with the mushroom vendor for PC. Uh, of course, we use the search mushroom, click on it, and it shows us exactly where the guy is for console or other versions. This guy is uh, right next to the big fat storage guy here. He's right here, yeah, that close. And here are all the mushrooms. Okay, next one up is the fruit vendor Milano. So this is pretty pretty far jog. I'll just keep this running here. How'd I do today in the intro? I tried to keep it really short, yeah. I don't actually watch game videos, but uh, when I used the Google earlier in the week, I was looking for this one video, you know, how to get fingerprints off a dead hooker. And so I get to the video and this guy's like doing the intro and it's like 30 minutes long, you know, like subscribe, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, well, you know, you said quick, here we are 34 minutes later getting to the end. So anyway, uh, okay, here's the fruit vendor. Boom. All right, next up we got the herb vendor knives and he's over here in the ghetto. So we're just gonna start running. I might actually put this on a, a faster pace just to keep this running a little faster here. Uh, so he's over here. You see all these protesters and then over here and he's right in here. There's other NPCs you can click on. Let me see if I can get him. Okay, and there we go, all the herbs. And while we're over here, I just want to point out that if you just go over here and then north, this is where the night vendor spawns on Calpheon. And he's actually really close to the energy vendor, which I'll get to in a minute here. But um, the uh, energy vendor in Calpheon is extremely quick to refill your energy. So on events like the Christmas event we just recently had and that one special day where we had this special night vendor, Santa Cron or whatever the hell his name was, um, you could run back and forth you know, refilling your energy and, and getting these boxes. And I'll show you, you might have a problem here uh, with all these protesters getting in your way. Here's a little trick I learned in prison. Okay, next up we got F for Dallas Herba or something. All right, so he's over here. Again, there's the storage on our right. He's right over here in front of this cooking place. Uh, this is the guy I was telling you about in the previous thing for the night vendor. If you go up to him and you pick up some of this high quality wine, I'm just going to pick up 10 here to demonstrate. Out of all the different energy uh, replacement NPCs, this one's the fastest. You can just, it's, it's as fast as you can spam R. So boom, uh, really, uh, pro tip, really good for uh, the special event night vendors. All right, we're almost done. A few more to go. Um, I'm still at this guy here, uh, the Herba guy. What I'm going to do is run next to... The guy that sells uh, life skill or gathering tools and whatnot. And he's right here, uh, Gerano. Uh, this isn't going to be on console yet, but I'll just um, let's future proof this video so I never have to do it again. Uh, he's got all the tools and all the blue and green items for life skilling that you'll get later. And just to be thorough today, let's go from the starting spot. Uh, just This is just basic information here and why I love Calpheon. Marketplace guy is right here. Imperial trade, uh, trade manager, imperial delivery, imperial trade delivery. And then usually I get this house right here for one CP because it's uh, right next to the marketplace and all these different NPCs. I mean, there's a big cluster here. Yeah, you can see it for yourself. Easy to find. And last but not least today is the guild manager. And you might be wondering to yourself, why is this guy seven miles away from everything else possible in Calpheon? And the answer to that is, hey, you know what? This is a Korean game. For some reason, they like to add stuff like this. You know, you see the ad for this game. Everything's like, you know, crazy uh, active fighting. And then uh, you're playing and it's like, oh, I got to spend 20 minutes running to a guild guy that's seven miles away from everything else. Yeah, I don't really get it either. Just one, just one of those things uh, with Korean games. So here we go. Of course, you have to wonder why you even have to go to a guild manager when you can just buy all the guild items on a tab and not have them weigh you down and stuff. You know, being a GM is real fun in BDO. And I did this video today because, you know, I was going through comments this weekend and there was a ton of console players like downvoting all my old videos that I made in 2016. I mean, that's like four years ago. There wasn't even a console version. It was only PC. So we had searched back then, right? 
Uh, so that's what pretty much I'm going to do this one today. I got about five more to do. If you're wondering where I was on commentary for the last four years, I was doing YouTube side channels. Um, yeah, it didn't work out too well. I was actually doing this one where, you know, I live in Florida near the beach. So I was going to do, you know, where I take a metal detector, go pro, you know, whatever, record a, sh a morning show, you know, put it live on YouTube every morning. So, you know, I spent like a grand and all that stuff to start that channel. And then, of course, you know, um, out there on my first day live stream, got like 30 viewers and uh, metal techers going off getting like bullet casings and uh, parts of old cars, you know, pennies. And then it goes off like with the gold or, you know, and I'm like, oh, go go on some digging a hole and like, you know, live stream and like people are like, wow, you found treasure. And I was like, yeah, this is, this is going to be the best channel and job ever. Right. Sure enough, um, as soon as I start digging, dead hooker, 